We now have uh, Congressman Sarmiento back on the line. Good evening, sir. Hi, good evening, Angel. Yes, sir. So, are we uh, on schedule for the? Uh, are you on schedule for the expected approval of the budget uh, happening by next week? Yes, yeah, so far so good. But we uh, still have to deal with some uh, departments that uh, has been rescheduled. But uh, we're basically uh, uh, so far so good. As I said, we're basically uh, hitting our target. So, are there any issues, sir, or certain? Uh, certain issues that are being raised uh, against the uh, approval of the um, certain items in the budget? Uh, it's quite normal in a budget deliberation that we do uh, encounter some um, queries from our colleagues on a certain department. But uh, if we uh, try to uh, compare the budget deliberation uh, in the previous years, uh, there is a great improvement. Uh, uh, one of the reasons for which uh, I guess is the, the line uh, budgeting that uh, we, we currently have for the 2013 budget. Mm. So, so what are what are these departments? Uh, those who propose amendments and uh, what departments will be getting additional allocations? Uh, we don't actually. Uh, uh, the, the, we, we know that uh, the, the committee has somewhat noted some of the recommendations, but there's going to be a period of amendment wherein the committee will be accepting some proposed amendments uh, on uh, the, 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 the budget. But um, there were uh, uh, some manifestations uh, made during the deliberation of the possibility of uh, uh, providing additional funding for a certain department. But of course, uh, it's going to be a, a tough balance act, so to speak, uh, in trying to balance because once you, you take out something from one department, then it affects the, the other departments as well. So it's going to be uh, carefully studied by the committee once we're in the period of amendments, uh, looking into the proposed amendments of certain items uh, uh, in the proposed budget. So right now, so there are no confirmed uh, departments yet, uh, which we are sure of that will be getting additional allocations. No, we don't. We don't uh, have that yet as of the moment. We're not in the period of amendments, but uh, the committee is taking note of some of the recommendations, and uh, members are likewise free to submit uh, proposed amendment to uh, uh, to the budget. So, sir, uh, will there be realignments in uh, some departments? We we don't we don't have that yet. As I said. Uh, uh, Whatever is there, there, there are certain uh, uh, items that are being looked into the possibility of probably revisiting the figure uh, uh, in, in, the, in the budget on how we can likewise look for ways to increase or probably reduce certain items and do some realignment for us to be able to, to probably add more on a certain program and probably uh, reduce mm -hmm. Some of the programs, and uh, looking as well at the uh, the uh, eventually the absorptive capacity of a certain department. Lastly, sir, are our local government units looking forward to uh, an additional amount to their uh, IRA this year? Very much, very much. Uh, there's going to be a, a great improvement in the internal revenue allotment. Uh, it's a some of the local governments will be able to somewhat recover what. Uh, what they lost for 2012. Uh, as we all know, the basis for the computation of the 2012 internal revenue allotment, the collection of the BIR in, in 2009. And uh, there is a great improvement if you compare the collection of the BIR uh, with that of the year 2010. It is going to be the basis in the computation of the internal revenue allotment for the year 2013. There is a great improvement of almost uh, around uh, 80 billion pesos. So, uh, uh, 70 to 80 billion pesos uh, and uh, there's going to be an improvement in terms of the allotment that the local government units are going to receive from uh, the national government all right that's certainly good news to our local government units on that note thank you so much sir for joining us tonight on news life Most that welcome. Was, uh, thank you congressman mel sin and sarmiento